This is a Birdlast for Android tutorial going over the basics of the app as well as trip cards. Let us create a new trip card. Tap the add trip card button in the bottom right. Give your trip card a name. This name can be anything, it is, it is just a way to group your observations. If you are an atlaser, toggle atlasing on, otherwise leave it off. Tap the check pass mark to save. Tap on the newly created trip card to open it. This is where you'll log your observations. You can log either in list or map view. Tap log to log a new species. Search for the species. And tap the species to log. Let's go over some of the trip card options. Tap the back button in the top left to return to the trip list screen. Tap the trip menu and tap edit trip card. You can change the trip name, atlasing and state from here and tap the check, check pass mark to save. You can also hide your trip cards either from the menu or through edit. You can access your hidden trip cards through the menu and then tap hidden trip cards. You will notice there is no log button as the card is now marked as inactive. To reactivate the card, tap the menu button, edit trip card, and set the state to active. Tap the check pass mark to save. To go back to trip cards, tap the menu and then trip cards. Other options available for trip card is to delete the trip card, email a summary of the trip card, or export and email a CSV of the trip card.